Hey guys, Original Boris here, and look what we got here today. All the way from Winkle Foods, pistachio muffins. This is a six pack, $3.98. As you can see, there's one missing because my daughter Mia decided she was hungry this morning. She wanted breakfast. Imagine that, gotta feed the kids breakfast. And uh, she wanted a pistachio muffin. So I, ha I myself haven't tried them yet, but we're missing one because Mia had one for breakfast. But um, go, go ahead and open this up. Oh, it's already open. We'll go ahead and grab one. Here we go. Nice and soft there. Smells pretty good. But uh, there you go. Winko Foods in Richland, Washington. Let's go ahead and open it up. You can see right there, there's the pieces of sugar on it. Pistachio, the green from the pistachio. Very nice. I actually bought these about two days ago. But I've been waiting. But now that they're open, might as well review them. I had intended on reviewing these with Mia, but she decided uh, she wanted to try them before. So that's okay. There you go. We'll go ahead and take out the whole muffin. As you can see, it's a, it's a green color. There you go. They, and I think it's got... I think those are pistachio nuts. Let me try that. Yes, it is. What do you know? It has actual, actual pistachio nuts in there. Very good. The nuts are good, but I like pistachios. But right, let's go ahead and try the muffin. Okay. It's pretty, uh, it's an interesting. I like pistachios, but I'm not sure I like it in a muffin. Uh, I'm not saying it's bad because it is good, but it wouldn't be something that I'd have all the time. Um, I do like muffins, but I prefer the blueberry muffins, the chocolate muffins, um, those kind of muffins, the regular muffins. Uh, this was something new, so I want to try it. It is tasty, but this would have to be something that I'd try on a rare occasion. Just because it is different. It's got a different taste to it, but at the same time, it's good. But just not great like your regular muffin, like I said. But uh, taste is not bad. The nuts that are in there are good. They're a little soft, though. They're not the crunchy nuts because obviously they've been they've been cooked in the muffin. So they're soft. They have a soft texture. But uh, all in all, this is good. Just not something that I try all the time. It had to be that rare occasion or... Uh, You go to the store, just like what I did. I went to the store, I saw a new muffin that I had never seen before, so I wanted to try it. But, like I said, something I try on a rare occasion. But all in all, it is good. It'd be a lot better without the nuts. The nuts are good, but I think this would be a lot better without that nut in there. But, I have to say, it's different, it's unique, it's new. And uh, for that, I'll give them a thumbs up. And I'll say... I'll recommend this for a rare occasion. I don't recommend this for all the time for that rare occasion. If you're craving a, a different type of muffin, this would be it. Other than that, I wouldn't have it all the time. So I have to say, it's good just for that rare occasion. But anyway, that's it. I'm going to go ahead and uh, kick back and then, uh, enjoy this since it's uh, different and new. And like I said, it's not bad. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe down below. And like I said, you can find these at Winco Foods for uh, $3.98. Bye.